No, 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 my gorgeous Scorpioni. No, 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 no. You're not ready just yet. I know that you're going to try to do something really huge at the beginning of this week. You're almost going to try to make some kind of announcement for something, like really excited. But Sasha says, no, baby, no, not just yet. Okay, so you are really going to be working on something so important to you. You're going to be thinking about so, something so important that you have been thinking about, you know, for ages. And this really means to you so much. So this is why you're going to feel at the beginning of this week, like so excited to kind of declare something. But the reason why I said no, baby, no, is because you must not rush into it just yet there is still something that's missing there is still something that you need to do there is still something that's missing in all this I know that this sounds really probably crazy what am I saying right now but trust me at the beginning of this week this is indeed uh, going to make a sense you will know exactly what I mean so what you will want to declare what you will want to kind of like kind of not as such start but declare like you're ready for something no not just yet there is still a one more week this week that needs to kind of go this week needs to pass so the reason why is because something very interesting is going to happen to you this week and what is actually going to happen is going to open your eyes and it's going to make you aware of exactly what you need to learn in order to be completely ready in order to declare something so there is still an element that's missing and it's so important and when you become aware of what is exactly that that you need to learn it's only going to seem something like really tiny, something really little and something almost insignificant. But as the time goes by from the first moment you open your eyes to it, this is going to like kind of shine brighter and brighter and brighter. So by the end of this week, you will know exactly what is missing along all these that I've actually said so far. So the bottom line is when you find yourself wanting to declare something so excited, I don't want to put you off life or anything, no baby, no, but I just want to make you aware of the fact that there is a, some kind of like a final examination that it's going to become obvious only at a time when you become aware of exactly what do you need to learn and what do you need to learn, what's missing, it's going to become evident precisely on the L and on the very 12th of March 2023 and this reading is obviously in between the 6th and the 12th of March but on the 11th and the 12th of March you will know what you need to learn and then after that you are going to be ready to start okay you're going to be ready to declare this so this is really really important indeed you have no idea how much vibrancy into your life it's actually going to bring how much confidence into your life it's going to bring you're not only going to become a very magnetic after this moment in time in order to naturally attract things into your life which you need at this stage of your spiritual journey so the next four weeks are going to be absolutely magnificent mind-blowingly important when it comes to you paying attention to the ideas that you are going to have for the first time in your life which is direct result of you going through so much over the last two or three years but most importantly you learning fr from what you went through you didn't realize this is at the time but now this is going to become absolutely obvious and what else I really really like my gorgeous Scorpioni right at the beginning of this week you know what it's actually what is going to happen as well at the beginning of this week you are really going to feel so excited and happy because you are going to have an opportunity for a big change in your life this opportunity that you are going to become aware of right at the beginning of this week also it's going to really help you to connect with yourself and reconnect with yourself if i can say it like that because it's going to help you to open your eyes and it's going to help you to understand what exactly you want in order to be 
happy, but also in order to reconnect with those people in your life who mean to you so, so, so much. You're also going to become aware of an important, important, important reunion. As some kind of blast from the past, somebody is going to make themselves known and this person is really going to surprise you. But this person is also going to play a mind-blowing role when it comes to you being valued. When it, when it comes to you like kind of feeling like you are valued and that in itself it's also a like kind of going to uh, help you to understand that now it's time to like uh, leave certain things behind because this is uh, going to indicate the process of your own transition where you are entering pretty much so really calm waters after so much that you've been through and you're entering such a healing stage which is going to bring so much progress into your life but first of all you are going to need to understand that you need to move on from those things that no longer serve you and now you're moving on with your life and now you're going to find so many things that are really bothering you so many things that you are bored of so many things that are making you feel really negative everything is going to gain some kind of momentum momentum here and it's just going to push you to move forward with your life so important my gorgeous Scorpioni indeed by the time you get to the mid part of this week, oh my God, something really interesting is actually going to take place. Do you know what? Now I'm going back 16 months, <laughs> one six. Within the last 16 months, something really terrible happened to you. Something really bad happened to you within the last 16 months. You had a really, really bad and negative experience that in life that really threw you off balance, you know? And that in itself happened the last six, within the last 16 months. It basically, it caused, uh, uh, it's, it, it's to do with a sudden, a sudden negative situation. It's to do with some kind of trauma that you've been through. It's to do with some kind of unexpected change is to do with some kind of disaster, some kind of negative revelation that caused so much confusion into your life. But then at the same time, this now, why is midweek important? Because for the first time in your life, you're about to find mental strength because you are having your own awakening here. And this in itself, it's also going to kind of make you aware of the fact that now it's time to rejoin the world, baby. But at the same time, you are coming out of some kind of isolation here as well. I'm not saying that you've done anything wrong or whatsoever, but I'm just saying that you were going through a very negative and dark stage of your life within the last 16 months, and this really affected you. So now you're only, you're, you're finding pretty much, so you're going to find a mental strength here to deal with the problem that was created then and there, that was created exactly 16 months ago. And you know, this in itself, it's going to be so brilliant. You know why? Because it's going to show you exactly how powerful and how capable you actually are. Because this in itself is going to reveal your own truth to you. And that in itself, you know, it's pretty much so going to make you aware of um, I know you're going to find yourself like, oh my God, shall I do something or not? Shall I do something or not? Shall I do something or not? And this, what is going to be on your mind is pretty much so to do with you needing to be brave and confident. And the most certainly the answer to that question, that question, my gorgeous Scorpioni, is going to be yes. But what you're going to need to do here now, it's like a basically, so, you know, what was created 16 months ago, it also at the same time created this blockage in your life. Only now you are going to have a mental strength in order to deal with this and all this is going to lead towards you understanding that you have to come up with some kind of structure, you have to come up with some kind of a plan, you have to be come up with some kind of routine here as well and you need to be patient at the same time. You need to be intelligent, you need to be rational, you need to be logical and you also need to be authoritative when it comes to your own life. The more authoritative you are, the more you put your foot down 
down with things uh, against the things that don't make sense to you, the more powerful you're going to be. And also somebody is going to give you such an excellent mind blowing advice as well. And the person who is going to give you a mind blowing advice, there is something that you find so fascinating about that person. And perhaps this is going to be directly given to you, or maybe you're just going to be watching someone and you're just going to get through the power and synchronicity, the right advice at the right time. You know, the advice comes in many different ways, my gorgeous Scorpione, because we are the part of the multiple dimensions. We are the multiple dimensional beings. So make the most of it. Reflect. Be open-minded. You know, go with the flow, with those things that are attracting you. Even if they don't make sense, they are your call. They are part of your spiritual journey because they are ultimately holding a key for you. You know, you, you get a key which helps you to unlock the door that have been locked for way too long in your life. So this particular advice that you're actually going to have, it's really kind of going to, oh my God, it's going, going to make you aware of the importance of honoring your spiritual self. But at the same time, this excellent advice that you're going to have, you're going to find this like so enlightening because you are going to start like a, some kind of soul searching after that moment in time. So it's a lot to do with the spiritual enlightenment, but it's with self-reflection, but also at the same time, you know, it's going to put you in a mode to kind of uh, like, you know, to search for deeper tr th truths, you know, in your lives. Like, oh, wow. By the time you get to the last part of this week, my gorgeous Scorpion, it's like a basically somebody. This is to do with a man, with a very kind of significant man in your life who is like pretty much so in touch with his emotional life. And this man is not afraid of his emotions and this man Man is not like afraid of showing his emotions as well and this is somebody who's like a very good to you and this somebody who's very much so a mature person and somebody who's emotionally stable that particular person is actually going to play an important role when it comes to you knowing exactly uh, how to nurture your life and that person is also going to be quite important especially when it comes to you opening your eyes and understanding the specific choice based on sincere feelings okay so this is going to put you closer to some kind of dream of yours as well this is going to create a very deep feeling within and that in itself is going to play an important role when it comes to you understanding and realizing what a significant time of your life this actually is like oh my god and also another thing I was going to say around the end of the week, my gorgeous Scorpioni, you are going to have a, such a good news. This good news that you are going to have, it's going to open your mind, but it's also going to make you aware of like, you're going to becoming, you're going to become a willing to learn. And that in itself, it's like, oh my God, it's like really going to this good news that you're also going to have, it's most importantly going to, you know, really, the bottom line is that this good news that you're going to have, really, it's going to show you clearly the progress in your life, the progress that you've made. And this is going to show you, a, you know, this is going to make you feel really exciting excited, but it's also going to make you aware of the exciting times are about to come. This is a lot to do with your own freedom, my gorgeous Scorpione, but it's also to do with the certain things that you were working on for so long, paying off for you as well. This is going to make you feel very excited and very energetic because this in itself is also going to provide you with a solution with a very, very annoying problem. And then on another hand, it's clearly going to show you which plan do you need to abandon now as well. So now my gorgeous Scorpioni, I'm just going to take these oracle cards and I'm going to see what your oracle card of the week is actually going to be. Okay, so what your oracle card of the week is going to be my gorgeous Scorpioni, what your uh, oracle card of the week is actually going to be. La 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 Oh my god. Luminous. You see this? What you need to understand is 
you, your energy is going to be out of this world this week, throughout this week. I will tell you this now, to find something to work on that you want to work on, something that makes you feel really good, something that makes you feel really excited, something that makes you feel really alive again. It really depends on what, at which stage of your spiritual journey you are, at which stage of your life you are. Something that you're working on, something that you want to achieve, something that you want to be noticed by. I'm telling you, the more energy you put towards something that you want to be noticed by, the more successful you're going to be. Something magical is going to happen purely through your own creativity. So let's say you're a painter, you're painting picture, you're an artist and you're painting a picture and now let's say that's what you do you want to make a really good picture you want to paint an amazing picture you want to paint a mind-blowing picture you want to make a paint a picture which is going to change your life because everybody's going to realize how powerful you are how amazing you are how different you are how unique you are you know and at the same time what you need to understand so let's say you want to paint a picture and so now you start painting that picture if you're like an artist and then you put as much as you possibly can in in towards towards it throughout this week and something really magical it's going to happen something really mind-blowing it's going to happen you will be rewarded for what you were doing and on top of that you're gonna be noticed by the people who you want to be noticed by and even if you're painting this picture just by yourself in your little room on your own for example it doesn't really matter it's all about that connection a reconnection with the greatest power within which is a going to bring the energy up which is a sacred energy that I'm talking about and this in itself it's going to give you a chance to have a really mind-blowing spiritual shortcut towards the path you want to rejoin with again this in itself it's going to make you find yourself again but at the same time it's really going to start the mind-blowing process of an absolutely uh, 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 such a powerful uh, um, you know uh, change in your life and this my gorgeous Scorpione it's also at the same time it's going to make you aware of exactly your own power you will realize by the end of this week how, week how powerful you are but something very very specific about your skills that are very unique to you are going to be highlighted this my gorgeous Scorpione it's something that you really need to take on as a number one at this moment in your life Okay, my gorgeous Scorpioni, thank you ever so much for watching my videos. I'm sending you brightest blessings, lots of love, healing, peace and light to every single one of you, my gorgeous Scorpioni. Thank you ever so much for watching my videos. Sasha Bonasin, Psychic Medium. Love you. Bye.